Hey everybody, this is Chris from HD Models. Thought I'd give you a little update on the work on my 1350 a scale Academy Bismarck. Started to do some photo etch on it. Doing all the railing. I'm working on that down ladder right now. Everything's... I wouldn't say as far as uh, in a bad way. Everything in here fits really well. It's a little bit older model, so it's got a little flashing here and there. Nothing a little massaging wouldn't take care of. But other than that, I don't have any complaints with this. I chose not to go with the aftermarket guns only because of the simple fact that they don't really make... Um, the guns that go with this for Academy. And I don't want to take the chance of buying a gun set for Tamiya or whatever and it not work. And then you end up with something you paid pretty good money for to not even use. So I chose to just go with the standard guns on this. But I do have on my HMS hood, they are aftermarket barrels for it. This one I just chose not to because... They're a little difficult to get, and I didn't think these looked too bad. I might change my mind as I go along, so <laughs> bear with me. Otherwise than that, like I said, that, that wooden deck is kind of like the kicker for me. I, I really like it. Um, the only issue is you have to lay the deck down to know where the railing goes. If you don't, and you put the railing on first... And then you lay the deck down and the rail's in the way because you put it in the wrong spot. Um, then you're going to have some issues. Otherwise, after this, I've got to go back and pretty much mask everything off as far as the deck goes. And touch everything up. <clears throat> but I do have it uh, break down to where I, you know, it's just all, um, sorry about that. It's all just sitting here. It's not. It's not glued together. So at least in that circumstance is that I can just go ahead and take the individual units apart and I can paint them. So, and then, you know, I'll, uh, whoops. And then I'll go ahead and, and um, put it back together. Other than that, if you paint it and then you go to glue the railing on and stuff, you're going to mess it up and you're going to end up with some issues. So... I just kind of figured this is the easiest route to go for me. Now, for other people, it might be different. So, you know, to each their own. This is the way I chose to do it. So, um, the PE kit that I got for this is really, really good. Obviously, the doors, if you... Uh, um, um, have them open. The back sides are just, sorry about the, the reflection, are just um, a solid piece. So the doors have to either be, you know, well, they have to be closed. And I just don't choose to buy another photo edge kit to um, get the backing of these doors. I'm not that much of a rivet counter. Um, I still have to install... The um, breakwater uh, braces. I've already done one side, but I have to do the other side, um, which go. That's one side that's done. I have to put the other set over here. So. Still a long ways to go. Um, I'm thinking about putting maybe a soft red light in there so that it'll light up like it's at nighttime. I don't know. We'll figure that out as it goes along. But anyways, I thought maybe I'd give you a little heads up. This is just a little update. All right, you guys. Have a great day. Remember, any model, anytime. See ya.